Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm doing my week 15 update of the Chloe Ting challenge. Before this video gets started, I wanted to address something. I get a lot of questions. What plan do you follow of Chloe Ting? What workouts have you done each week? The first question is always, what program are you doing? I pick and choose of what I feel like will benefit my body and I feel like I get the most out of it just because I like to do that, I like to have that control. And then second of all, I have a whole playlist that I have made up. And in all of the videos, I talk to you guys and show you some B-roll of everything that I've done the past week. So if you watch through the whole video, you'll know what I've done. So that kind of answers that question. If you want that playlist, it is in my playlist section and it's all of Chloe Ting's workouts. Now I'm gonna get on to starting with the weekly update of everything that I've done this week. So that shouldn't be a question in the comments. Anyway, so Saturday the 25th, I did the 30 minute workout. That's the 30 minute full body workout. It's the top of my playlist called workouts in all capital letters. And then I did the flat abs. I just kind of named it this in my head. It's the two week shred. It's part of the two week shred challenge. And um, it's like how to get flat abs in two weeks. So that's that video. It's about 10 minutes, I think. Then on Sunday, the 26th, I did the 15 minute workout. It's the 15 minute full body workout. It's, I think it's the third in my playlist. I'm not quite sure. And then I did the 11 abs workout. I named it 11 abs. It's basically how to get the 11 line ab definition in 10 minutes in two weeks, something like that. On the 26th, I also did the toned arm workout. The toned arm workout is about 10 minutes. She just provides a lot of like arm workouts to do and I find that one very beneficial and then on Monday the 27th I did the 2019 shred full body challenge it's about a 28 minute video it is the hardest workout that I ever do of Chloe Ting and I always choose to do that on Monday just to really push it I always have to do some of the modified exercises because I can't really do it it's really really hard and then I did the 11 line ab definition I really like the 11 line ab definition because it has like a wide range of exercises. I don't know. I just really like it. And then I did the bra bulge. So this is where um, she does all these workouts to work on people's like back fat in that little roll that lays under your bra strap. Really need that and it's actually really benefiting me. It's amazing. So Sherry, Valerie, and I are going on a walk. I just got done with my Monday workout. Obviously, I'm not going to vlog it because it's like in our neighborhood and it's a little sketchy. I mean, even though if you were to find where out where I live, which please don't do that again, that's creepy and weird. Uh, you get lost anyway. Sherry and I have actually gotten lost in our neighborhood. Everything looks the exact same. Trust me, you would have a hard <laughs> you would have a hard time finding this place. Anyway, I just want to document that because it's still part of my workout journey. We are going for a little stroll. That's definitely not high intensity, but it's still something. Tuesday, I do not have any footage because I don't work out on Tuesdays. Wednesday, the twenty. 29th, I did the 15 minute workout. It's the 15 minute full body workout and the love handle workout. The love handle workout is about 10 minutes and it's one of her newest videos. So I would check that out. It's really fun, pretty challenging but fun at the same time. Also, you'll see in this video, some clips of me saying, oh, I'm going on a walk with mothers or I'm gonna go on a walk with Sherry, which you're gonna see that in the next clip because we have gone on a couple walks in our neighborhood and it's been nice. I also wanted to mention that mother Sherry and I went on a little half an hour walk around our neighborhood um, after I did my two exercises you just saw. Thursday, I do not have any footage because I don't work out on Thursdays. And today, Friday, May 1st, I did the 30 minute full body workout, the back bulge workout, like the one that I just talked about. And then I did the booty workout. I love the booty workout. It's so challenging, like my butt. I've never really done exercises like that, but the past two weeks I've done the booty workout on Friday and I'm hoping to get that little peach butt, you know? That is pretty much everything, like touching up on the exercises I've done. I think I'm gonna stick to this routine um, just because I really like it. I really like the different things that I've laid out for myself and I find that it's beneficial and I see 
results or at least I feel good in my body when I do it. It's a nice balance is what I'm trying to say. So for updates, the biggest updates, there's actually two big updates, but one update, you're gonna get more detail and everything on Wednesday. So make sure you're subscribed. And if you haven't entered my giveaway, make sure to do so. I'll link that video in the description so you guys can see it. One, I had McDonald's for the first time in such a long time. It was so good. Uh, Valerie, the night before was like, oh, I had McDonald's just so you know. And I was so mad that she went to McDonald's and didn't even like ask if I wanted anything. So the next night, Sherry and I are like, we're having McDonald's. And the reason why we pigged out, had our like one big fattening, really bad for you meal is because we have started a low carb challenge. I don't recommend this if you're under the age of 18, don't have like your parents permission, struggle with, you know, body image and EDs. Like I highly don't recommend you do that. I'm not a nutritionist whatsoever, so I'm not promoting this. It's just a fun thing that Sherry and I are doing. And so that's a really, really big update that is coming more on Wednesday. So make sure you're getting my post notifications. So when I release that video, you can see the transformation kind of. I also wanted to address my blue mat. <laughs> my blue mat is so popular. You guys are like, oh, it's so satisfying watching that blue mat move. And honestly, guys, I really like watching it move too. It's kind of satisfying because when I'm doing the exercises, I had this time-lapse feature on this camera, which is amazing. So I don't really have to do a lot of editing when it comes to it, but I watch it too, guys. <laughs> it's really, really funny. Sorry, my refrigerator just turned on. So if you hear anything, it's that. Yeah, a lot of people wonder why I have a microwave and refrigerator. It's because I went to a university and I had this stuff and then when I moved back home, there was nowhere else to put it. So that's a little short anecdote for you. I haven't gotten a lot of comments about this, but I just wanted to like put it out there. I know my form isn't the best, but in my head, I'm like, at least I'm trying, you know what I mean? Like at least I'm doing something and not sitting on my butt for half an hour more during the day and I'm like getting up and like getting active. And number two, when we do, the, when I do like those things where it's like this, like, gosh, I'll put a thing on the screen so you guys can see. But when I'm doing this exercise and I'm going like down and up, I cannot put my hands like this I'm trying to like show you. I can't put them like this and I know that's the proper way, but literally I don't think my body goes that way because it really, really hurts my wrist. I cannot do that. Moving on to the photos, cause I know that's what you guys wanna see. You might see a little bit more of a bigger difference. I don't know, I don't wanna put it out there and have people like, Alex, there's like literally no difference. But I feel a lot different in my body and everything. So here's the before and after photos. So on the left is Alex last week. On the right is Alex this week. And remember guys, during this time I'm doing a low carb challenge. So that's probably why I probably look a little less bloated. So this is the side view of that. So Alex on the left is last week and Alex on the right is this week. And this is obviously my favorite part. <laughs> These are the pre-workout photos compared to now. So Alex on the left is pre-workout Alex and Alex on the right is current Alex. And this is the side view of that. So Alex on the left is pre-workout Alex. Alex on the right is current Alex. And I must add, if you guys have any suggestions on some low carb meal slash food ideas, please leave them in the comments. I would love to know what you guys did. I know I got a few responses on Instagram, which is amazing. This one girl said cheese and salmon were like the things that like saved her during it. Well, not saved, that sounds more like negative, but um, she gave me that. I have been eating a lot of salmon, so that's really good. If you have any suggestions, leave them in the comments. And I think that is about it for this video. So give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel so you can see that Wednesday video. And I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye.